Today we're shining the DBL spotlight on what makes us happy. The answer may be in Yale professor Lori Santos's class. Her course, Psychology and the Good Life, has become affectionately known around campus as the happiness class and is the most popular in Yale's history. But the really happy news? Now you can enroll online for free. Joining us now for our very own DBL Happiness Crash Course is Professor Lori Santos. And happiness is a big concept, so what is a small change we can make immediately to be happier? Really what the research suggests is that simply by engaging in your own kind of easy practices, some of those practices are just things like savoring, trying to stay in the present moment, um, trying to reduce your mind wandering. Another easy happiness practice is gratitude. Try to practice um, appreciating the things that you have and even doing simple random acts of kindness for other people. But you say part of the issue is our misconceptions about happiness. And I've heard the term that you get in your own way. How do we get in our own way? Really, it's our minds that get in our own way. Our minds tell us that to be happy, we need to do certain things, like we need to change something about our lives. But really, what to seek out to be happy is just to do simple things, like seek out other people, trying to have time for yourself, a concept that researchers refer to as time affluence. And what are a few tools that uh, the DBL viewers and myself can use to create their own happiness? Let's talk about in the long term. The research suggests that very happy people tend to spend a lot of time with others. And that suggests that if we want to be happiest, we should just prioritize the people we care about, spending time with our loved ones. So when you hear about a happiness course, a lot of students seem to think that this is an easy course to take. But you, in fact, say it's one of the hardest courses. Why is that? Yeah, we created this hashtag, hardest class at Yale. And the reason is that becoming happier is hard in the sense that what we really need to do is that we have to fight our bad habits. We need to put into place better practices. Now, for the first time, people don't have to go to Yale to take your course. They can do it online. So for more information, go to Coursera.org. That's Coursera.org. Thank you so much. Thanks so much.